Hundreds of people turned out tonight to remember this popular bar owner and University of Central Missouri graduate. And Fox Force Robert Townsend joins us live in Warrensburg tonight where a candlelight vigil is just now wrapping up. Robert? Hey there, Susan. What a turnout tonight for Blaine Whitworth. Take a look and you can see a lot of the people still here gathering and remembering this special guy. Again, a candlelight vigil for a special tribute for a special guy. A guy a lot of these people are still missing and mourning. Blaine's parents, his grandmother for whom Molly's Bar is named, his two brothers, several hundred friends, customers, and college buddies all packing the street to remember the good times they shared with a 25-year-old bar owner. Of course, lots of hugs and lots of tears as this community mourns a son, a brother, a friend. Tyler Worley worked for Blaine at Molly's Bar. Tonight, tell us how you remember him. Uh, this is the best man I ever met. Uh, pushed all of us to be the best we could be. Uh, never meet a more intelligent, caring guy. Uh, took in people he didn't even know. Uh, helped out mul multiple people. You told the crowd tonight that this tragic loss has just hit at the heart of you guys. Tell us about it. Uh, you know, it's just uh, anybody that Blaine knew he affected. He, uh, you know, everybody that knew him knew that he was a hard worker. Uh, and just uh, like his mom said, his smile. You know, he just smiled at, at anybody you know you could see in the darkest room. Yeah. Uh, Tyler, thanks. I appreciate it. Again, sorry for the loss. Again, Blaine's mother speaking to this crowd tonight. She told everybody to not be mad, but just remember her son's million-dollar smile and try to make a difference in the community, just like he did. We're live in Warrensburg. I'm Robert Townsend, Fox 4 News, working for you.